folks, welcome back. Here we are again. Oh yes, what can I say? Now, I hope you've all been keeping well. Today's workout is a 10 minute shoulder workout with dumbbells only. Now, there's a reason why I've decided to do this today. After my last video, uh, as you recall, I mentioned a friend of mine called Carl, who all he owns is a set of dumbbells. That's it. He hasn't got the luxury of a bench or anything. I get that because they do take up space. Uh, but after speaking to someone last night who watched that video, they said, Chris, that's a good video. And I'll tell you why. I said, why? He said, because all I own is a set of dumbbells. He said, and I don't really train very often because I don't really know what to do. I said, what do you mean you don't really know what to do? He said, well, apart from curling, shoulder pressing, you know, some lateral raises and that. <clears throat> he said, I just keep repeating the same thing because I don't really know what to do. I haven't got a bench or anything. I'm like, you don't need a bench. You don't need machines. So I'm going to put it like this. If you own a set of dumbbells and you don't really know what to do when it comes to training everything, I should say, it's quite simple. There's an easy, easy, really solution to this. Subscribe to my channel. Watch my videos, you'll see what to do. It's not hard. YouTube, you can find anything out on YouTube. It's not a problem. But after speaking to him last night, I thought, okay, I haven't done just a 10 minute shoulder workout with dumbbells only yet. So I said to him, I'll make a video for you. So at least now you, you've got your, what was one of them the other day again, back and bicep workout. You've got a back and bicep workout that takes only 10 minutes, dumbbells, nothing else. I'll make a shoulder one for you. So to whoever that person was that was talking to me, because, oh, sorry, I can't remember your name, I'm afraid, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, this is for you, you know? And it's also for everyone else out there who just own a set of dumbbells and nothing else, and they're short on time, i.e. it's only 10 minutes, but still. So, <clears throat> The reason I've got a band, yes, I know it's the same old, same old thing. They're extremely good to warm up with, etc. And I'll keep going on about it, but it's the truth. But the reason I've got the band now is because we're training shoulders. Hence, I've been standing there for a quite a while warming my shoulders up. So I'm all set now and I'm ready to go. So we're going to crack on. But first off, north and south. Are you ready? Feet together. Hands in your chest. Look up. Look down. Look up. Look down. Elbows out, elbows in, all the way over. You know the crack. Just relax, relax for a second. Then bum hands, cast feet, whatever you like. You grab and breathe all your air out. Woo! All the way up. Support your pelvis and look behind you. Right, left hand, left hip, looking at your right palm, corkscrew all the way up, bend your arm, point to the left, pushing your left hip with your left hand. And throw your arm over. Right hand, right hip, looking at your left palm, corkscrew all the way up, bend your arm, point to the right, pushing your right hip with your right hand. Then throw your arm over. And grab your ball all the way behind you. Don't forget to lift that heel off the floor as you're twisting. Oh, that'll do. Shake it out. Right. I'm warmed up. I'm stretched out. Oh, yes. I'm ready to go. Same as before. It's 50 seconds continuous. We have a 10 second transitional period. Uh, oh, for God's sake, hold on. Oh, for God's sake. Sorted. 10 exercises, 10 minutes. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll, baby. All right. First one. Weird outs. Bum out. Simple as that. So you can see from the side. Bum out. Good posture. Right up this. As you can. Really try and throw them through the ceiling if you can. The more of a contraction you can get on these rear delts, the better. Ugh. 
bleeding out, she's like lightweight really. <laughs> Crucifix, if you can, at the top. Yes. And relax. Oof. Right, front lateral raises. My style. Exercise. Right in front of your face. That way. And twist. I don't know, this one yet. Ah, I normally start that way, sorry. <laughs> then that way. Basically, palm up, palm up, and a fist up, and a fist up, palm up. Hold on, palm up. I said that first time. I went palm down. <laughs> now, I've explained in previous videos why I do it this way. It's to do with muscle memory. If you do it there all the time, when you get a punch there, you're going to be weak. Just about to be on Right, shoulder press. <coughs> Exercise. Now, when you do shoulder press, don't come below your ears. When you come below your ears, down here, all this is rotary. That's how you knack your shoulders. You only really need to come to where you don't really need to touch the weights. You can just do that if you want. Uh, to 90 degrees really, or just past 90 degrees. Basically that's 90 degrees there, somehow, I think. Dumbbells face me is it's just below. You don't want to come below there. You can, but don't moan at me later on, later on in life, and your shoulders are knackered. Stronger to cope with the heavy loads that you're now lifting. 
your little stabilizing muscles do not get bigger and stronger. And that's when injuries occur. So it's very important, even if you just do that to warm up with a light weight, to try and do little rotary muscles, rotary cuff muscles, little stabilizing muscles basically. Right, Cuban press. One of my favourites. Oh, favourite mate. Suss this thing out so I can stop doing that crap all the time. Right, <clears throat> what can I say? Done and dusted. 10 minutes, quick as that. That's a good shoulder work. I mean, you know, do you know what? Just goes to prove my point, you don't have to go heavy. My shoulders now, I feel so pumped, it's unbelievable. 10 minutes, that's all it's took, you know what I mean? What more can I say? Right, so that's it for today. 
I hope you like the video. I hope there's something you can take from it. If all you've got to your possession when it involves training is one set of dumbbells, then surely there's a lot you can take from this, you know. And that's all I'm saying on the matter. So, north and south to finish off with again. Are you ready? Feet together, hands in your chest. Look up, look down. Look up, oh, look down. Elbows out, elbows in, all the way over. Oh yes. Oh, that feels nice this time round. Right, just relax and grab whatever you like and breathe all your air out. Raise up, support your pelvis. Ooh, look right behind you. Oh, yes. Right then. Left hand, left hip, looking at your right palm. Corkscrew all the way up. Bend your arm, point to the left. Pushing your left hip with your left hand. Fray your arm over. Right hand, right hip, looking at your left palm. Corkscrew all the way up. Bend your arm, point to the right, pushing your right hip with your right hand. And then throw your arm over. And then grab your ball. Right behind, far as you possibly can throw it. Don't forget to lift your heel. Very important. God damn, that feels nice. Oof. Shake it out. And that's it. Benito, you can... Crack on with the rest of your day now, knowing that you've had a decent workout. It's only took you 10 minutes. Oh, yes. So, until next time, like and subscribe. Recommend it to all your friends. If you want to see any kind of workout, even if it is like, I don't know, a 10 minute workout with dumbbells, anything. 10 minute workout with a barbell. Anything you want to see. 20 minute workout, whatever you like. Drop us a line below and uh, we'll see what we can do. So, until next time, you take it easy. Boom!